When I was first told I'd be teaching MFL, I was excited and slightly scared. I had done French and enjoyed it at school, but hadn't done anything since then. L'accord. L'accord, oui. We have a mixed year four, five and six class with a very big ability range. Excellent, well done. Only Primary is a deeply rural school in Herefordshire, but despite its remote location and having fewer than 80 pupils, they are already delivering French. Bonjour la classe. It's all made possible through the dedication of one teacher, Alex Hallinan. With only GCSE French, Alex has developed her own language skills through personal study to a point where she's confident to teach a combined year four, five and six class. Okay, we're going to start off with a song this morning, okay? Après toi, un, deux, toi. Je joue dans la corde, dans la corde, dans la corde. Je joue dans la corde, dans la corde. Je mange dans la salle à manger, salle à manger, salle à manger. Je mange dans la salle à manger, salle à manger. Je jardine dans le jardin, le jardin, le jardin. Je jardine dans le jardin, le jardin. Je travaille dans la salle de classe, salle de classe, salle de classe. Je travaille dans la salle de classe, salle de classe. Excellent, très bien. Assez à vous, s'il vous plaît. Merci. OK, today, thinking about our bigger picture and thinking about the work that we're doing to form our presentation to send to our partner school in France, OK, and having learnt to say what we do around the school, Today's lesson objective is to talk about where different members of staff work around the school. Okay. To start off with, we are just going to recap on our different places around the school. Qu'est-ce que c'est? Katie. La salle des profs. Excellent. Très bien. La salle des profs. Oui. Hmm. Qu'est-ce que c'est? Brian. La salle de classe. Excellent, oui, la salle de classe. Qu'est-ce que tu fais dans la salle de classe? Tu manges? Non. Mm, Qu'est-ce que tu fais, Kira? Je travaille. Oui, excellent, je travaille dans la salle de classe. Tout le monde? Je travaille dans la salle de classe. Oui, excellent. Qu'est-ce que c'est? JJ. Le jardin. Excellent, oui, le jardin. Oui, tout le monde? Le jardin. Oui, excellent. Euh, Qu'est-ce que tu fais dans le jardin? Sarah? Euh, le jardin. Dans le jardin. Sarah, le jardin ou je jardine? Je jardine. Excellent, oui. Je jardine dans le jardin. Oui, excellent. Tout le monde? Je jardine dans le jardin. OK. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to introduce you to the people around the school and their jobs. OK. So, ici, Madame Coates. Oui? La directrice. Écoutez, la directrice. Maintenant, répétez après moi. La directrice. La directrice. La directrice. La directrice. Excellent. Hmm. Megan. Madame Ablé. Madame Ablé. Oui. La secrétaire. La secrétaire. As-tu les instits? Oui. Tu as les cartes? Excellent. Dean. Jacob, as-tu la bibliothécaire? Oui. Tu as les cartes? Oui, la bibliothécaire. Très bon, Dean. Très bon. Annabelle. As-tu Nikki bibliothécaire? Non. Non. Ce n'est pas la bibliothécaire. Hmm. Jessica. Nikki. As-tu le secrétaire? Oui. Oui, tournez la carte. Le secrétaire. Le secrétaire. Excellent, Nikki. Très bien, très bien. Merci, merci. <coughs> merci. Right, what we're going to do now 
is we're going to use those new words that we've learnt and we're going to put them into a sentence to make some sentences. Okay? So. La secrétaire travaille dans le bureau. Travaille. What does it mean? Hannah. Work. Work. Excellent. Good girl. The secretary works in the office. Oui? Excellent. Tout le monde. La secrétaire travaille dans le bureau. Excellent. C'est vrai ou c'est faux? C'est vrai. Oui, c'est vrai. La phrase. Katie. La bibliothécaire travaille dans la bibliothèque. Oui, excellent, c'est difficile, oui. La bibliothécaire travaille dans la bibliothèque. Excellent, Katie. Mm. Ah, regardez. Les instits travaillent dans les salles de classe. Why do you think I put an NT on the end of travail? Sophie? Because there's more than one person. Excellent, good girl, very, very well done. But, écoutez bien, what do you notice? Les instits travaillent dans les salles de classe. What do you notice? It's pronounced the same. It is. Excellent. The NT that I added to the end of travail is silent. <laughs> ah! Excellent. NT. Excellent. Good boy. Ah! Mais les instits travail dans La salle des profs, c'est vrai ou c'est faux? C'est faux. C'est faux. Merci beaucoup. Regardez. Ne aime pas. Megan. Um, you put the ne before the travail and the pas after the travail. Travail or travail? Travail. Travail, oui. Come and do that then. <laughs> Excellent, merci. No. Les instits ne travaillent pas dans les salles de prof. They do not work. Ne travaille pas. Now, what you're going to do is you are going to practice making these sentences. True sentences, vrai, or false sentences, faux. And we're going to play Pelmanism. La bibliothèque. La bibliothèque. La yeah. Now, what we've got is we've got a list here of professional people and where they work, OK? Now, what you're going to do is you're going to see if you can use the dictionary to find the words for mechanic and for garage and to put those into a sentence, OK? Using our verb, travail. You might even be able to do some negative sentences once you've found some of your words, and you might be able to use n and pa around the verb. Okay. Is laboratory masculine or feminine? Masculine. Okay, so is it going to be le 
or la? No. Le. 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 Good girl. I'm doing a does not. Ah, okay, so what do you need? To... Le chef ne travaille dans le garage. Oui? D'accord? 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Excellent, merci beaucoup. C'est facile ou c'est difficile? Ah, comme si, comme ça, comme si, comme ça, excellent. OK, very, very well done today. That was an absolutely fantastic lesson. You've used loads and loads of language and you've linked what we learned last week to this week. So we're building up everything that we've known and you've been fantastic, so well done. Do you feel now that we've got a little bit more information that we can put in our presentation when we present our school? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, yeah. excellent. That's really, really good. Very pleased with that. Good work, thank you. So how is Olmley able to deliver a language with such considerable success? This model works well in a rural authority because some of the schools are isolated and it wouldn't be possible for them to have a visiting teacher. Um, it's sustainable as well. So it's about building capacity, about helping teachers build language into the curriculum that it becomes an integral part of the curriculum. Je lis et je... Excellent. Having not done any French since GCSE, um, I have had to revise my French, um, which has been enjoyable. Um, and building up a bank of words that you can rely on in instructions is, is very useful. No, ce n'est pas le stitch. The children respond very, very well to MFL. Um, it gives them a chance to practice, to speak about things a lot more, um, which improves their confidence across the board. Oui. It's important to keep the pace going. You've got quite a lot to fit in, lots of different activities, and the children will learn quite a lot in a very short amount of time. With the mixed year groups and the mixed ability, it is very important to differentiate the tasks and ensure that you are stretching the more able pupils. When the children were consolidating their learning, they were actually doing different activities. One group were doing a writing activity, and the objectives that they were meeting there were from year six and some from year five. Whereas in other groups, they were doing simpler tasks, which may have been more appropriate to the objectives of year four or year five. We're advocating in the LA, in Herefordshire, that all schools teach a minimum of two years French. When secondary teachers know that the children who come to them will have had two years of French, they can build progression and they won't be starting from the beginning in Year 7. They'll be moving the learning on. The advice I would give to anybody who's been asked to teach MFL is to try and be as enthusiastic as possible and take on as many opportunities to practice your language and any training courses available to you. Find your MFL persona and go with it. Très bien, très bien. Merci.